<laughs> Lovely. That's how you start. Great stuff to get the Turkish team off the mark. So how does Ukraine respond here? Hunbin to go first for Ukraine. Nice. To the nine, not too bad, but a mini advantage for Turkey. Can Ali Aydin match Samit Ak and put it in the ten ring? Oh, into the seven when the pressure was on, the teenager floundered. Opportunity for Ukraine to get themselves right back in this. Huge advantage for Ukraine here. Even oh. Itzkai puts it into the eight. Tied, one arrow. It's a gold medal match that keeps giving. And it's down to the two anchors. So again, if they tie and score, we're going to go closest arrow to the center. Mete Gazos. In Great to shot. the 10 ring on the X line. And that is the closest arrow to the center here. So not only do Ukraine need a 10 to draw level on score, they need to get it closer to the spider. Over to Makarovic. Oh, it's in the nine. It wasn't bad shooting from Ukraine, but Turkey have taken this despite a seven on their second arrow. Turkey are the gold medalists here in Berlin. Just shows you anything can happen in a shoot off. Wow, I can't believe that seven did not impact this match. Amazing stuff. Got Turk Ergin, the coach there, celebrating Ali Aydin. Well, got away with a seven. Smiles on the faces of Aydin, Ak, and Mete Gazos. They'll be on top of the podium here for the recurve men's team event. And there is confirmation from the target judge. Turkey are the champions of Berlin. And I think it's a safe bet to see. This is not the last time we're going to see them standing on a podium. Handshakes all around, very respectful from the uh, teenagers uh, on the Turkish team. Osipenko shaking the hand of his uh, counterpart, Ergin, as well. The two coaches showing a great deal of respect for each other. The photo call for this young Turkish team. Den wir eben gesehen haben. Die Recurve Herren Teams.